Dwayne Johnson's net worth. How much is The Rock worth in 2024? Dwayne Johnson epitomizes the archetype of a superstar. Arising from his roots as a professional wrestler under the ring name, The Rock, he has seamlessly transitioned into one of Hollywood's highest paid actors. With an illustrious career marked by blockbuster movies and multiple lucrative business ventures, begging the question, what is the magnitude of Dwayne Johnson's net worth in 2024? Mastering both the art of action-packed thrillers and unexpected comedic roles, Johnson stands as one of the most prolific figures in the entertainment industry. From his iconic role in the Fast and the Furious series to his superhero stint in DC's Black Adam and DC's League of Super Pets to voicing Maui in Moana, he has aced different cinematic genres with much finesse. Beyond the silver screen, The Rock has ventured into entrepreneurship, recently launching his men's skincare line, Hapatui. Furthermore, his portfolio includes a tequila brand, a clothing line, a production company and coveted endorsement deals with renowned brands. These ventures collectively contribute to his remarkable net worth with the star earning an estimated US$100 dollars annually. From a humble beginning with a mere seven United States dollars in his pocket, here's how Dwayne Johnson built his million-dollar empire and cemented his status as a titan in the entertainment and entrepreneurial realms alike. Born on the 2nd of May 1972, in Hayward, California, Dwayne Johnson, son of former professional wrestler Rocky Johnson, had a nomadic upbringing. His family moved from New Zealand to Hamden, Connecticut, before settling in Honolulu, Hawaii, and later Nashville, Tennessee, during his high school years. Displaying exceptional athletic prowess, he received numerous football scholarship offers and chose the University of Miami where he played a pivotal role in securing the national championship for the Hurricanes in 1991. Despite his football success, Johnson faced setbacks when he joined the Calgary Stampeders in the Canadian Football League, leading to his early release. The actor later opened up about his struggles during this period recalling the time when he looked at his wallet and realized he had only seven United States dollars to his name. This didn't stop him from continuing to dream big. Johnson later named his company Seven Bucks Productions. That's what we can convey. Don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe. So that we are enthusiastic in conveying other trending news. Thank you.